hey guys welcome back to my channel and today i'm going to be showing you uh into a game that i haven't played in this channel before although i do like it quite a bit uh and it's called clash of clans so this is my account uh right uh so yeah it's just my account that i play on don't do very much like fun like i don't, I don't do too much on this um like i play it a lot but i haven't made any videos on it before so today I'm going to be focusing uh, on Builder Base. So uh, I'm going to be showing you a three-star attack. So these uh, on Builder Bases technically weren't made to be three stars. They were they're spammed with traps. They've ha got a high level defense and mi limited amount of troops. But I figured out a way that I can free three star it pretty easily. So ignore the losses I have here. But look, so that's one. That's, that's one three, three star. Then that's two three star, three three star. And there was a fourth one, except it was underneath and has got lost. And I've got quite a lot before that as well. So I'm gonna be showing you this method I used to get a three star in the builder base. So let's just go straight into it. So this base would be a perfect one to three star because there are a few defenses on the outside, such as the, uh, the multi mortar and the firecracker as well as the double cannon, which makes this base a perfect one to go in three star. So, the uh, army I used to three star builder bases is I used uh, six giants and four uh, cannon carts and one battle machine. Doesn't matter what level, you can boost your army if you want, you can boost your heroes if you want, but it doesn't really matter. I just attack with these pretty low level troops. And it's actually possible, so I'll just show you guys. And so there's uh people are like debating whether you should spam all your troops in the builder base. Uh, I think not actually, but that's just my personal preference. I just feel like, oh yeah, okay. I just feel like when you spam your troops, uh, it just creates a diversion and it's just not as good in some way. Uh, and like yeah, so. Sadly, this attack didn't go the way I wanted it to, although I'm going to keep trying until I get it. So, yeah, so uh, normally you want bases that don't have any, like, opened up spots in them. So, sadly, this one wasn't an optimum base that I would normally attack to get a 3-star, but uh, I'm probably not even going to win this attack. Uh, but, yeah. So I'm going to try again, and I will see you when that happens. Okay, so guys, I've got my next army. Uh, I guess I did use my clock tower boost, because I'm impatient, and that's just the way I am. Uh, so I'm going to go and attack, and, yeah, and find this pretty nice base. So the way I'm going to attack this is I'm going to go in opposite the crusher, because that thing is deadly. So I'm going to try to take, in, take out this double cannon start. So I spam all my troops down, place in my uh, battle machine, place down my cannon carts. And the way this, this attack works is uh, first the giants go in and they'll take out all the defenses while tanking the defenses attacks, right? And then the battle machine will also go in. It will also help tank, but also do a lot of the damage to the buildings in the middle where like, for example, now he's going for the town, for the builder hall, right? So it does a lot of damage. Uh, but not just to defenses. And I have no idea why these... Oh, okay, so, yeah, it got a little messed up here. But this is still a possible 3-star. I doubt it, but it's still possible. Normally when you 3-star on the water base, it's like by the, m the tiniest amount that you actually get it. So if you look, uh, somehow, by some magic that I do not have, my cannon carts have actually funneled themselves into the town hall to attack which I find is pretty neat. Uh, and yeah, so this is pretty much how you get a three star. I think I'm actually quite close to a three star. So that battle machine is gonna be taken out and then the giant's gonna also be taken out. But if you see now, there's no more defenses that can kill these two cannon carts, which means we have the three star. So yeah, that's why uh, I like the build base so much because it's just a very different to the regular base and and you can do like a lot of weird stuff. So the way I get this, so if you think about it, the reason I can get three stars 
is because I think of the builder base differently to a lot of people. A lot of people think like, oh, I should save troops because when all my other troops die out, uh, they're still building that I can snipe. But really, you just want to get all your troops in there so then they attack. And then the more damage you do, the better. So, yeah, I just get all my troops in uh, at the start so then they can attack it like it's a normal base, but it's not, which makes it slightly strange. But, yeah, so with this strategy, you're very likely to get a good, a good old... Uh, three star. Uh, so let me. I'm gonna. So that's one attack. Uh, I'm gonna show you another. So this is probably gonna be my last attack of this video. But on um, okay. So uh, with if okay. So right now this is a build hall five attack, right? And if you see a guy with a uh, a roaster, that's probably a sign that you're not gonna three star. You can still try because the strategy is still just a great strategy all round. But it's very unlikely that you'll get the three star. So as you can see, I'm using the exact same strategy. And yeah. So uh, this strategy is actually pretty unique in the way that uh, open bases uh, don't work too well on this. Uh, because you want your, your giants to get into the core as well as your battle machine, which I failed to do, of course. But yeah, if you fail to like get your troops into the core then it's just not going to go well the whole attack so they're going so we've got the town hall we've got the two star so this could very well be a pretty good attack but whether it's a three star or not i doubt it will be uh we might get maybe the 70 mark 70 percent mark but yeah i doubt i highly doubt this is going to be a three star so yeah as you can see, attacking the... Actually, wait wait a minute. This might actually be the three star. And now that I come to think of it. Because they're going to go and take out the mine. And then, where are they going to go? Yeah, they're going to take out the arch tower. Hey guys, this could actually be a three star. Oh, no. That spring trap did stop it from being a three star. But, did I win? Yes, I did. So as you can see, even if you don't three star this attack, it is still it can still help you uh, very easily yet uh win the attack so this attack if you look if you like have a take back it's a builder hall five he's gone to a builder hall six but then he hasn't real. he ha he's just built it onto his builder hall five face which you should never do by the way uh because uh when you do this it just like makes all your it i don't know it just there's something about it it just your builder five base has been like designed to be perfect for Builder 5, not Builder Hall 5, not Builder Hall 6. So, yeah. So I was really hoping, okay, yeah. And this was is very unlikely to get a 3 star as well. Although the Roaster and Crusher are in one spot. So if I can get like my Builder Hall, ah, uh, my Battle Machine there, as well as my, a few cannon carts, I may be good, but I would highly doubt it. Because, uh, as you see already, all my cannons, all my giants are gone. So, yeah. So, this is generally a Builder Hall 5 3-star. But, sometimes you can be lucky and get a Builder Hall 6 3-star. As I almost did if it weren't for that spring trap before. So, yeah. I got the 2-star. And I normally aim for at least the 2-star mark. Because that just gives you a chance at, get, at winning. So he three starred me this time, which is slightly ironic, but yeah. So you get you get the idea. So just to revise, uh, the strategy is boxer giant, uh, boxer giants, two army camps full, and then two army camps full of cannon carts, and then your build machine and battle battle machine. So, uh, guys, that's all I'm gonna have for you today. Uh, and I'll see you all later. Bye. For those of you who watch all the way to the end, look, I used, I just attacked, but then suddenly my versus battle rewards came. You're gonna have to do a bunch more attacks. Bye guys, for the last time. See you later.